You know, you got to be more careful with who you bring on. I like, trust her, bro. Free. That's yeah. why. <laughs> yeah. As terrible as the Holocaust was, they found a couple of really groundbreaking discoveries. No, literally, it was because of her. When people go in and rip a, a content creator apart like that, no matter what, like, like really happens, it gives me anxiety. It doesn't make sense science-wise to say that you are eating the same as somebody who's a size zero. Like, you begged her to come hang out with me. I didn't know her or you, but she pulled you a favor. I urge everyone to check out Colossal is Crazy's interview with Lion Maker. It's surreal. Yeah, I mean, and he went to jail, and he then he deserved to go to jail. Like, which is whatever. Too bad. They're bringing their significant other that you dislike greatly. Hannah Mojo. Yeah. Mojo. Uh, I also take ownership for the Tana. The, the Tana thing mm. was, uh, was my... Oh, that was so long ago. Was my idea. And they sort of, like, sort of filled in the blanks and said, like, all right, you got to hate women. <laughs> you got to hate women like this or whatever. The truth is, is that I've been a giant piece of shit for the past, God, I don't even know how many months at this point. You listen to IDub's advice over the bond of friendship that you had with Celestia and eventually regretted that. No matter like how serious it is, right? Like even when Lion Maker, whatever his name was, was accused of like it gave me a lot of anxiety. You gotta be more careful with who you bring on. You didn't think I existed before, Ian. I did. How come nobody wants to talk to me on here? Um... Okay, hey, so there may or may not have been some neglect on my YouTube channel for six months. I would make this person my world and then I would expect them in turn to make, you know, have them make me their world. Well, the more you Photoshop, the more you run away from self-acceptance. My photos are not real. You're also causing other people to not understand that it's okay to accept themselves. My photos are not real. It's it's a very detrimental thing to do. We all want to look our best. As terrible as the Holocaust was, I trust was her, bro. That's yeah. why. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. You know what you're doing? What am I doing? You're breaking my trust and in turn my heart. What breaking what the, what in God's non-existent name are you talking about? I've are sacrificed you, so much for this podcast. All the little tumblerinas telling me that I'm cheating on my boy. When you come out like that, just like hate that Tana like Ian's like what the f Fine, we'll get your f girlfriend on here. And then and I reach out my hand and I say, here Chris, let's ignore the haters. Let's make a podcast anyways. And then you turn around and you fine, we'll get your f girlfriend on here. Get off of the internet and pursue a fulfilling job. What's it like to hear Ian do a bad unboxing? It's just like a bunch of just an artistic screeching for like hours. Are you still going to New York for that concert? Yes. Are you sure you don't haven't canceled it? Like Are you sure you haven't canceled it? Because you found the love of your life? You found the Pocahontas to your John Smith? You want to understand her land and her ways? What are you saying? You want to understand her land and her ways? Like Poca she's your Pocahontas. So you come from two different worlds. <laughs> your brain is not at a place yet where you're like, I'm doing this for me and I don't give a f what anyone thinks. And you're going to focus on those negative comments. Guaranteed. I'm sure I'm going to get a lot of comments. I, I literally, I missed so much of what you said. Because you screamed it into the microphone like a <laughs> lunatic. Like a, like a deranged like psycho in, 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 in solitary confinement. She described you as a psycho fan in her video. Yeah. Because you found the uh, love yes. of your life? You found the Pocahontas to your John Smith? Sure, you know that, but yeah, I guess yeah. you have insecurity about it. Because yeah. Of Kim Star and people like him. Shout out to Anissa, your wife. I mean, dude, I've been begging for a woman's creator fight. We finally got it. You guys delivered. Creator Clash uh, is a is a W for sure. Thank you guys. He wants Jerry Springer. Yeah, right. Right. Like that's kind of like Jerry Springer, but with like severe head injuries, <laughs> basically. Give me the most disgusting thing you could possibly think of. Um, Lacey, uh, you, you can't rely on yourself. I don't know, cause I I'm I'm impulsive and I don't like having the same thing all the time. She that's didn't know. Did you see Pyro Cynical's video about Twitch girls? Lol. No. I don't why do you want me to see that so bad? This actually makes me so mad. 
It's just unfortunate. You could like flip a coin, you're either liked by the community or not liked, and it's basically decided on what the community has decided are like good commentary channels. And then the commentary channels give their subjective opinion or like, you know, hate on somebody, and then the whole community decides to hate that person. And I, it's just kind of sad because I just don't think it's very fair. Of what I said about Pyro, I'm just not in the mood for it. People seem to all of a sudden care what my opinion on it is. It's just sad seeing somebody get ripped apart that hard. Fine, we'll get your f girlfriend on here. It's a bit scary to rip somebody apart, you know, without really knowing. Uh, I also take ownership for the Tana, the, the Tana thing. Okay, so there may or may not have been some neglect on my YouTube channel. I, I need, we need to all chill out. Nobody's, nobody's broken up. Nothing's happening. Stop asking my mom questions. Ian, as well as everybody else on that platform, did they don't have the ability to to um, end the plague. Look at how Tana Mongu's doing right now. And that's what bothers me. Instead of me being an angry, fine, we'll get your f girlfriend on here. I should be focusing on myself and on my dad and his happiness and on my family and their happiness and my stream and its success and YouTube and you guys like No, but it'd still be in a row <sighs> So we were both right. Yeah, so we it was one right. of the few arguments where we we both came out on top Yeah, it was well, really weird. I think a lot of my opinions were a little bit like uh, what what's the word? Libertarian? Uh, yeah, mm -hmm. I just kind of stupid um, <laughs> This is really bad. Yikes takes. Why is it bad? Is it- it's bad that I'm trying to be a reasonable human being and I think we, like, hate people way too aggressively online that don't really deserve it? Give me the most disgusting thing you could possibly think of. Um, Lacey, uh, Is it- it's bad that I'm trying to be a reasonable human being and I think we, like, hate people way too aggressively online that don't really deserve it? You know what you're doing? What am I doing? You're breaking my trust and in turn my heart. What breaking what the what in God I've sacrificed so much for this podcast. All the little tumblerinas telling me that I'm cheating on my boy. Fine, we'll get your f girlfriend on here. There's like some days where I ask Ian, like, have I ruined your life? It's just like a bunch of just an artistic screeching. But like Ian and how he feels about how he wants to put himself on the internet has changed. Because you screamed it into the microphone like a <laughs> lunatic, like a like a deranged, like psycho in in, in 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 solitary confinement. They found a couple of really groundbreaking discoveries. You gotta be more careful with who you bring on. Yeah, I'm sorry. I'm trying to, I, yeah. 